Cranston fourth grader delivered a thank you gift to local health care workers today. I would see reporter Courtney Carter was there for the special delivery. 10 year old Ryan Goldage says he felt discomfort wearing masks, but then he thought about people that may have it worse, such as hospital workers that have to wear one for hours every day. So he put his skills to use to make it more comfortable for them. Fourth grader Ryan Goldage had a problem. His mask that he had to wear outside were uncomfortable, which is why he decided to fix that himself. The ear elastics were not comfortable on it, so I thought that I could print it on my um, toy box 3D printer. I thought it was very comfortable, and I thought about the um, people that were fighting the coronavirus on the front line. Thinking about the doctors, nurses, and other medical staff that might also have the same problem every day. He spent hours at his 3D printer making dozens of 3D printed mask hooks and ear savers to help fight discomfort for healthcare workers at Hasbro Children's Hospital. Each bag takes about an hour and 30 minutes for the printing, and I have eight bags, so the printing uh, took about 12 hours. I like that since they're fighting the virus on the front, hand, front line and we all get the luxury of staying home and being safe, I wanted to give back to them. I made this for you, heroes. Aww. His mom says she is very proud of her son for thinking about the heroes of this pandemic. And doctors that got the delivery were even more grateful. It's so nice to have Ryan showing up here today, and you can tell he's worked really hard to make all of these uh, attachments for our masks. And it is true, these masks get hard to wear uh, day in and day out. Uh, my ears do get sore. Now, Ryan told doctors and nurses he wants to be an engineer when he gets older. And after dropping off those gift bags, they all say he's off to a great start. In Providence, I'm Courtney Carter, Eyewitness News.